I'm immensely proud of my students. We lack facilities that many schools take for granted. So as a teacher, I just want to have a positive impact, not only in my country, even the whole of Africa. Teaching is in my blood. My father was a teacher. My uncles and cousins were also teachers. I admired the kind of work they are doing in the society. I thought I'll be able to make a real difference. I am a maths and physics teacher at Kiriko Mixed Secondary School. The school is in a very remote area. The students, most of them, they come from very poor families. I joined the religious life because I wanted to be able to dedicate myself wholeheartedly to helping others. Caring for people is in my heart. Before I joined this school, I was teaching in a private school which was well equipped, had all the facilities. Most of the students there were that top crew. And then later on, I felt that the surrounding communities, they also needed my help. I said, let me stretch and extend the same love to the surrounding community. And that's what made me come to this school. We are going to start with mass. Okay, someone to remind us what we talked about mass. Students in this school face so many challenges. They come from very poor families. Even affording breakfast is hard. When they are in school, they are not able to concentrate mainly because they are not able to get enough meals at home. Lari area experiences famine every three to four years. Food insecurity is a major problem and teaching the members within this community on new ways of farming is a matter of life and death. We are now heading into the dry season. And he trained us the alternative ways of growing vegetables. That garden will take very little water and it uses a very small portion of land. Through Peace Club, the students are united, they conduct debates, they carry out tree planting, and all of that brings them together. We need peace in our communities, we need peace in our world. Here in our school, we have already planted our trees. That is one way of promoting peace. By encouraging my students to participate in science club and the talent nurturing club, they become very innovative. Our project is about generating electricity, electric current from plant extracts and sewage waste. We went to the science week and we were called to present there. We became the winners been featured in the local newspaper. I feel recognized. To be a great teacher, you have to be creative, embrace technology. You really have to promote those modern ways of teaching. You have to do more and talk less.